guys? It's your girl Alex here and I'm back with another video. <laughs> um, I'm trying to come up with an intro video for y'all because I don't know. I feel like I'm I, I feel like um I want to get creative for you guys and I listen to music every day and I think I found a song that I like that I'm gonna use. But <laughs> That's not why you came here. That's not why you came here. No, you came here for, you wanted to know a review on the Meraki hair oil. I forgot to go get that, so let me, uh, I'll be right back. And I'm back. <laughs> I'm back with it, okay. Um, I already put it in my hair. I just got out the shower. As you can tell, I have the same shirt on from the last video I did because this is about, like, the lightest shirt that I have. Um... So we're just gonna make do with this. Um, first things first, how I feel about this. Do we, uh, let me see. Should I start with the pros or should I start with the cons about it? Um, I'm gonna start with, hmm. All right, I'll start with what I like. So what I do like about this stuff is um, when I put it, when I put it on my scalp, and I massage my scalp for however long. I'm probably gonna, when I'm done with this video, go back to massaging the, <laughs> the massaging of the scalp. But um, when I massage my scalp after I'm done, it gives off like this cooling, like tingling sensation. And it feels so good. Feels so good. Um, I feel like... Because I remember, like, I, I used it, I think it was, like, a week, and I did a video for you guys, and I didn't post it. If I still have a clip, I'll post, I'll put it in here somewhere. I'm not sure if I still have that clip, but um, I felt like there was a little bit more growth. I could be wrong. Um, I feel like when my hair is dry, I feel like it's a little bit fuller. Not, nothing too crazy, because, like I said, it's only been, like, two, maybe two and a half weeks. So, um... It's nothing too too crazy, um, but it is it is a little bit fuller. Um, I'll do a length check at the end. Um, I'm trying to think. I do feel like okay. Whenever I put it on, I do feel like my scalp is very moisturized. The only thing that that sucks for me is that like no matter no matter if my scalp is clean or dirty and it's always been like this since I was younger. I don't know if I don't think it has anything to do with it, but my hair, I think I think and um don't don't come at me in the comments or don't come at me, but I think that um I can feel when my hair is growing. So I don't know if that's why my, my scalp is itchy, but I really think that I can feel my hair growing. So, because, like I said, it doesn't matter if my hair is clean, my scalp is clean or dirty. Like, my hair, my scalp is constantly itchy. So, that's one thing. Um, I'm trying to think what else I like about it. Um, it gives my hair, like, a little, um, I guess, like, a shiny look or whatever. Um, now... Oh, excuse me. What I don't like about it, the only thing I can say I don't like about it, there's there's a couple things actually. There's a couple things I don't like. I don't like, and I didn't know how to explain it at first, but I saw somebody posted it on like posted it on their reviews. Like when I was looking up reviews, someone said like it has a strong eucalyptus smell. Now in the last video if you guys if you guys watched it if not I'll put like a bubble over here or over here I'm not sure which way it goes I think I think it's over here I'll put a bubble up so you guys can watch the last video but for the most part um these are it's all natural ingredients in here so obviously it's not gonna smell the best um the only other thing that I don't like is um when you're reading when you're reading the directions it says you know you can use it however you want there's no right or wrong way to use it but i just feel like in when in the directions it tells you like um it's all natural ingredients so there's no room for fillers meaning if you're using this this is it i just don't agree because 
not for nothing it is i mean when i'm done putting it in my hair feels really soft and at night i like to like twist it or braid it i'd be looking like young and may in this thing but <laughs> all jokes aside like um i don't know i don't i don't know if i like it when it dries because my hair feels absolutely dry so my thing is um i use this product i think it's called um hair food or something like that um I have another video coming out for you guys. I, I keep forgetting to post it. It's I have a separate video for that where it's like all the products that I have that I use in my hair at this moment. But I personally, even though it does say that there's no room for fillers, I personally don't think that this is enough for my hair. Um, it just feels really dry. So what I've been doing is putting this in my scalp and putting the other stuff on because the other stuff that I use when I use it at night my hair feels so good so I like it but other than that I mean I like it like I said it feels amazing on my scalp I feel like my hair my hair has been has gotten a little bit thicker it, it looks fuller to me like it looks fuller to me and um that's pretty much it for now um Length check. Where do we want to start? We'll start in the front. So, I'm not sure. If, like I said, I don't know if it got any longer. Length check. And then we got... Hold on. Pulling, like, from the back. So, now it got longer. Yeah, because it wasn't reaching. It's like under. Feels like it's like under my going TMI under my boob. Um, when I pull down, it's. My head is. I'm keeping my head straight. Um, it touches like the bottom. Like the, the bottom of my bra strap is right here. It touches the bottom of my bra strap. Um, let's get it from the back. From the side, you can see. Let's see. From the side, let me get it with my other arm so you guys can see. This is from the side, from the back. So I'm not quite sure if there's like a significant. Can you see? So I'm not sure if there's a significant amount of growth. But, like I said, in my opinion, it feels fuller. Um, the only, the one thing that I do want to add, um, the one thing I do want to add is that I've also been, I have two jobs now. I said it in another video. Um, one of my jobs, I work in a restaurant now. So, um, you know, working in a restaurant, you, I'm, I've been keeping my hair tamed so I've been gelling it a lot and keeping it keeping it in a um like in a high bun or a low low puff and you know how that goes and then like whenever you want to do your hair again the next day you got to wash your hair all over again so that could be part of the reason why maybe my hair like I'm not seeing that much pro pro um I'm not seeing that much pro cro progress <laughs> sorry guys I can't get the word out but um, that's another thing to account for. And we all have to remember that just because, just because um, the way, just because um, my experience with it, like just because my hair is growing, it might be growing slower, it might be moving slower, doesn't mean that you might not have like a different outcome. You know what I mean? So... Don't get discouraged if you get it and your hair is not growing right away. Like I said, I've been washing my hair every day because I've been gelling it. And then that goes to like, I'm washing this out and having to put in, put in more. And then I'm, I've been going through the bottle. I'm going through the bottle like really fast and I only had it two weeks ago. So keep that accounted for. Um, but when I, when I do get, I, I do plan on getting another bottle though. I do plan on getting another bottle, and when I do get another bottle, I'm going to just try and focus on my hair more and and 
not gel it so much, not wash it so much, and just so I can see my, my progress. But I don't know if you guys have any questions, let me know in the comment section below. Um, please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'm not really disappointed because at the end of the day, my hair... My hair is the longest it's been like in a really long time, so I'm not disappointed at all. Like if my hair, I, the only thing I would say, cause my hair, like I said, my hair touches like the bottom of my bra strap, cause my bra strap is literally right here. It touches it. The only thing I would say is maybe like waist length, and that's not very far. That's not. That's not far at all. So I'm like, if my hair doesn't get past waist length, I'm okay with that. As long as it touches my waist, we good. But I'm going to end this video here. I hope you guys like this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see y'all next time. Bye, guys.